Welcome back everyone to another episode of The Sea Life. On the last episode, we almost called it quits on the boat because we had had enough of the heat, sleepless nights, and jellyfish wrecking our plans. Today we woke up and explained to the crew again that we wanted to sail to clearer waters so we could explore the marine life. We had already experienced all the tourist spots since we were here last year, and our goal of renting the cat was to explore lesser known areas and find hidden treasures below the surface. As the day started, we were not hopeful, but it quickly turned around, and so we set sail south, and we were so happy that we didn't call it quits, because our first stop of the day took us to Pee Pee Island. This is the story of a family of four traveling the world as often as possible, sharing their adventures. Join us all on this season as we find exciting new places to explore, living this crazy life on the go. Please make sure to hit the like and subscribe button, and then also get notified when we release new videos. It really helps us out a lot. <laughs> to, to drink in strawberry kiwi beer at... I think it's strawberry lime. I guess it is 11.15. So, I think that Joel and I have decided that our morale needs to be improved, and so we're gonna start drinking. I think we haven't been drinking a lot because I think we're afraid that we're gonna get sick. Or, you know, and we haven't been seasick and we're on day four or five, who knows? There's no time on the sea. So we're gonna improve our morale and we're gonna start drinking. It's 11 o'clock, why not? We could. Cheers. I just came downstairs to check on you because I haven't seen you all day. Uh -huh. And you said you actually like your room and you like this. So what's what's the most surprising thing that you've found about being on a boat so far? Well, being on a boat, when it's whenever you're in a, like a game like Smash Bros or Pokemon Tournament or even just watching Pirates of the Caribbean, it adds an effect that normal rooms don't actually have. Yeah, so it kind of makes you feel like you're like in 3D or 4D yeah. in a way. So uh, what is the most challenging things you fi find so far on the boat? Going to the bathroom. <laughs> like, But you like it so far? So far. Nice. I like it. Still in the middle. Still in the middle. And Do you think you could live on a boat like this? Uh, no. Why? Because we would run out of supplies. No, we won't. Did you catch anything? Uh -oh. oh no. That's a big lure. We're just coming into, this is Pee Pee Island. Kind of a big difference so far already. It's sticky, but I'll take sticky over miserable. Yeah, you can at least get in the water. I don't see jellyfish. I'll still get stung. Maybe you're getting stung because you're just so sweet. And that's it. Or you're full of piss and vinegar. That's it. It's more likely is you're full of piss and vinegar. <laughs> it does look like a camel. Turtle. Oh, you think it looks like a turtle? <laughs> I can see turtle. Yeah, I can see turtle, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. Way clearer. Yay. You know what I don't see in the water? Jellyfish. Jellyfish! Or you. Or me. Yet. <laughs> Desmond's favorite part about the boat. The uh, Desmond escape hatch. I get lubed, yo. Lubed and tubed. Get lubed and tubed. Lube and tube. I don't know. How much are you putting on there? Just enough. No, no, no. <laughs> you are not kissing me with that on there. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Sticky things, yo. I'm going to try Sticky. this with my new mask and hopefully it doesn't fog. Wait, which Brand one's new. new. I don't even think I've used it yet. Here you go. Oh, maybe I have. Anyway, I'm going to try my white one. Yeah, I know, we have a pile of it. Oh, we do have a new one. This is my new one. This is my, my Scuba Weird. Pro, but this is a um, 
This is a free diving mask, which a lot of people really recommend, especially if you are like me and you have a really small head and and a really small, like narrow face. So we're gonna try the dive, ma dive mask and see if I can stop taking on water what? and not fog up. So I'm, I'm excited, I'm really happy that we moved down here. The water's much clearer and much calmer. The sun's even starting to come out, which makes it hot. So, but at least we get to get in the water because there's no jellyfish. So this is, I'm excited for this. Fine. This is what we needed, we needed this. Your butt's burning? Yes. My butt, that means my butt's gonna burn. Thank you, sir. Oh. I'm gonna sit next to you, Riv. Oh, look how beautiful that is. Wow. There we go, now we're talking. So we're gonna swim to our boat? I don't know. Where are we gonna hang out? we made our way towards the boat. The further out away from the beach we got, the better the marine life. I need to get better at free diving. I don't hold my breath very well. I can, hold I can my swim breath on well. the surface really well, but diving down my ears, because I've always had problems with my ears, it's really hard for me to regulate them quickly, like you need in free diving. So it's always really hard for me, but I'm trying to get better at it. Like I really, really want to get better. All right, attempt 575. Captain's log of trying to find the mask that will not leak. I think we got the fog thing situated. Now we're having an issue with the actual snorkel. To all those people who can just jump in the water and not have issues, we, we salute you. Happy girl. Hey. Grilled cheese sandwich and a Coke. I'm always happy. That's true, you are always happy. Okay, where did you say we were again? We're on PP Island Co. Yes, PP Island. And this is Hat Nui. Hat Hat Nui. Nui. Yes. All right. PP Island Hat Nui. PP Island, yes. I say it right. <laughs> That's because you want to be an interpreter. Maybe. What? I don't know what she wants to be. Alright, it's my turn to try to get something to work. There's this cool, like, reef right under the boat. There's so many awesome fish. I <sighs> Practice. It's hard. Okay, let's go. <gasps> you just have to be careful <laughs> when you come up. That's to hit the boat. Your head yeah. So, right below on the boat. There's this really cool reef. It's pretty far down there. I mean, <laughs> for me. <laughs> and um, I think it was my birthday or Christmas. Joel got me. I think it's Christmas. This. And he put lights on the top, and he put the DJI right there. 
And so I'm gonna go down there with some lights on and see if I can light up the, um, the reef and see if we can see anything fun. Whew. I think that was a beat. Ah! Got the DJI on here. And now, why don't you cross the other side? So this is the, oh, I gotta figure this out. I may need the super smarty husband to do this. Oh. Watch me struggle to figure this out because I'm mildly not smart. Uh, babe, I may need your help on this. Dad is showing me how to use this thing for the first time. I probably do. I just tightened it. Yeah. See, it's, so it goes like it slides in here. That's what I thought that I did, but then it. No, I had, go, I had it. Right. You had it right, but yeah. Then it's yeah, it's confusing. So it slides in like that, and it hits the stop, and then you push that back, and then you tighten it down. Because you do know that if we drop that, like, hopefully the boat crew can get it. Because <laughs> I can't dive down that far. Okay, <laughs> so here's the other one. So badass. Do you know what your chore is while you're in the water? What? Go scrub the bottom of the boat. No. Okay. <laughs> pretty clean. I know, you guys can see how much clearer it looks with these lights on. I can tell how much clearer it looks. But it's so pretty. So happy right now. By being in this spot. Ah, you got me wet. But don't you what? think that this is much better than that muddy water up north? Yeah, muddy. I mean, there's still quite a few jellyfish, don't get me wrong. Well, the little plankton are definitely stinging us, but I haven't seen any of the big jellyfish like you do up north. So oh, I, I abused a few of them with that camera. <laughs> oh, really? I didn't, I haven't seen any of them, but. Oh, there's some big ones. Yeah, this is much better. Over there, yeah. But this is like even just being able to dive just straight underneath the boat is awesome. And it's not hot. I mean, I'm sure I'm that, sure. that didn't help at all. <laughs> um, I'm sure. gets more attention than I do. I'm sure that it's like. We weren't in the water or something we might be hot but being able to be in the water is exactly what we wanted to be able to do so and there's tourists but they're over there so you guys eat grilled cheese sandwiches without i wasn't eating grilled cheese sandwiches i don't know what's in my ear what the hell is that weird shit you pick up in the ocean. Is there more stuff in my ear? Okay. Go eat your grilled cheese sandwich. Drink a beer. Oh, we're going for the hard stuff. Isn't it? Isn't it hard? Dude, you're wasting my vodka. My pretty face. Oh. 
<laughs> These are not gluten-free, lactose intolerant fish. They don't have a That's what I said. These aren't gluten-free, dairy-free, lactose-free fish. And they devoured that. That works really good. It's my lips burn. Does it? You tingling? That's where we're heading. You think so? Yeah, he told me. Oh, that's Monkey Island? Yeah. Oh. I don't know. What's this guy gonna do? Look at him. Just barreling towards us. Gonna crash into us, dude. Nah. <laughs> I did this. Tiger ball makes it go down. Show me. Yeah, it makes it go down quite a bit. And you put the tiger ball on. Yeah. When you don't, it gets really. You got definitely stung. That was stung. I know, it's weird. Dang. So, where are you laying a critical? about. <laughs> Were you supposed to do that? Yes. No. Well, she wasn't supposed to knock it off. Did I knock his head off? So when you're not allowed to have electronics, you make up your own game? Yeah. What'd you guys make up? I'm a po um, Pokemon game. So, uh, where's Ellie? Where did you put Ellie? Found her, found her. So she is a fairy type Pokemon. Mm. Fairy and water. Do you want grass? Uh-huh. What Fire. Were you? Wait, what? Fire and you're rolling dice or something and, yeah, and making a game? Run, yeah, run. one through two, it's a miss. Uh, five through six, it's a critical. What's four? And three. And three. Basic attacks. Oh, well, I like that you guys are being creative. Good job. Hey guys, sorry to interrupt this video, but I wanted to remind you to head over to Patreon where you can support us even further. There is so much more over there, including bonus content, where I show you even how to make a martini on a boat, and it's not that easy. So please consider supporting us so we can continue to bring you all of our fun adventures. Much love from all of us here at The Sea Life. Oh, hit that like and subscribe button too. The marine life in this beautiful area continued to entertain us. The fish were the largest we had seen so far, which means that it's time to wet the lines. Of course we didn't catch anything, but it was a good time for Joel to pass down generations of fishing knowledge and tall tales. You does that cast that? Yep. I cast that. I saw it. And up there. There. Yo, look at look look. Whoa! Do you see this fish jumping right there? Looking for something to eat. Maybe it should eat a jellyfish because there's lots of them. Maybe it should try, try to eat you. Or your wine. To try it out with these fries. 
come down and catch one of your chicken nuggets. <laughs> He's up there hunting. I cut my toenails today. Holy smokes, way to set your goals low. <laughs> oh, oh, look at the, the fish behind you are eating the jellyfish, babe. They're like eating it. Mr. Guitar's making Desmond's favorite mashed potatoes. Looks good. Yes, we can share the mashed potatoes. You can just move those out of the way. Uh, all right, you guys can have what they make next. <laughs> That's not all for you, yo. <laughs> Are you, <laughs> you silly. Yeah, you're gonna share with all of us. We were finally in a place where it was cool enough so Joel and I could enjoy our first highly anticipated sundowners. We discussed the day's activities and whether or not a time lapse was going to work out on a boat since it moved so much. We also decided to stay on the boat and continue our adventures. We were much happier being farther south where there was a lot less jellyfish and it was much cooler. The water was also incredible for snorkeling. Tomorrow we will continue to be amazed as we head farther south and everything continues to improve. Please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button before heading over to Patreon, where you can support our efforts even further. You get exclusive content, ad-free videos, and so much more just for showing your love. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.